What is up and what is Gucci Worldwide Web? <laughs> okay. So what is up and what is good Worldwide Web? It is your host with the most, Paul Cantu, reporting live and direct with a new exclusive tutorial video. So essentially what I got up in the mix today are a pair of Shat On beautiful suede Jordans. So essentially what I'm going to empower you guys with in this video is how to turn some dirty suede shoes into some sexy ass pristine Hordans. Without further ado, I'm going to get into the supplies, the technique, and the steps needed to transition these wax shoes into some crack shoes. Let's get it popping. So first things first, cracking into the supplies, you're going to need some Angelus Easy Cleaner from AngelusDirect.com for suede cleaning purposes only and to clean your suede J's. You're also going to need a toothbrush, shout out to Colgate one time coming through in the clutch, and then you're going to need some Red Lobster Jordans or any other suede dirty ass J's. You also are going to need, oh straight out the shoe, a nice palm sized hand brush if you are a diva, once again from AngelusDirect.com. And then also on the chopping block, you will need a towel, in this case I got a red one as well. So the first step is to get your little hand sized palm brush bristle thing and go hammer stand all over the upper of the shoe just to remove the dirt, dust, and grime that accumulates after years of just balling on motherfuckers out there in the streets. So as you guys can tell, I'm just going ahead and caressing these J's like my life depends on it, just rubbing that dust off like a young boss. And as you guys can tell, you gotta get that two, three clean and then get the inside panel portion as well. Just go ahead and go over all the dust. The next step is to get the Angelus Easy Cleaner. Read the directions, of course. It says shake vigorously, so you know your boy's about to get his shake on like a boss shout out to my girl Taylor Swizzle but as you guys can tell yeah just shake it and stroke baby then pop the cap on that ass and as you guys can tell you got an abundance of bubbles so you get the Colgate brush you just slip it and dip it all up in there nice and deep like you get it out you don't want to oversaturate just get enough of the bubbles all over that toothbrush and then you start going in. So you wanna start scrubbing the suede, not too hard, not too soft, but just right. Essentially, you don't wanna destroy the nice suede layers that have been purposefully and beautifully crafted in the Chinese warehouses and mother uh, workshops. You don't wanna destroy that. So you just wanna go slow and get in there all nice and deep like once again. But as you guys can tell, I'm going super fast and I'm just going panel by panel on the shoe, getting the toe cap, getting the upper, and you wanna cover the whole shoe that way when the suede cleaner dries it looks nice and even and has a beautiful clean coat all around so you guys can tell there is a bit of dust and grime so that's what you want to focus your attention on however once again just cover the whole shoe in its entirety get in there don't be hesitant about really scrub dub dubbing just don't go too hard just enough until you see results you dig what I'm saying but as you guys can tell right now I'm just getting the upper as well and as you guys can tell right here I had to pay extra attention to the upper part of the shoe right there by the sock lining because it was dirty just know that and what's beautiful about the cleaner is that if the plastic part of the shoe and the midsoles get dirty as well you can use the same suede cleaner just make sure you get it off and then make sure once you wipe down the grime and dust that's like integrated with the soap it doesn't get onto the suede because once again you're cleaning the shoes not making them even dirtier so as you guys can tell right now I'm just whipping out the towel like a boss and I'm just dabbing up the midsole first and then after that is completed you're gonna get that towel and just slowly start dabbing the upper and entirety of the shoe as you guys can tell I'm doing that right now now you may want to use a different colored towel that way you know you're not rubbing the suede too vigorously because if you do you will see that the towel is turning colors of the suede and that means you're rubbing too hard so just gently caress it slowly let it dry and if need be put it in a water heater closet let it sit overnight and just air dry as well but once again you don't want to destroy the suede you want to caress it you want to make love to it and once again you want your jays to look sexy restored and up to premium premium condition so as you guys can tell right now man these jays are done they're looking sexy and better than ever be sure to like comment and subscribe this was a quick vid but hopefully it helped out Peace out, y'all. Live the dream. Eat ice cream. And I will catch you guys next time. Links to all the products will be down below. And hopefully this helps you guys clean some dirty ass J's and make them look beautiful.